NATO can set up a 100 billion euro financial support package for Ukraine, President Volodymyr Zelensky announced on Monday during a joint press conference with NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg in Kyiv. Today we discussed Jens's initiative to create a special fund to financially support Ukraine's defenses in the amount of 100 billion euros for a period of five years, Ukrainian media quoted Zelensky as saying during Stoltenberg's unannounced visit to his country. It is important that this is not at the expense of bilateral volumes, earmarked in our agreements on security guarantees, Zelensky emphasized. In turn, NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg said that the alliance would increase the flow of arms and ammunition to Ukraine amid the war with Russia. Stoltenberg is also expected to address the Ukrainian parliament, RADA. During a joint press conference, Stoltenberg praised Zelensky's leadership and the bravery of Ukrainian forces and civilians and invited the Ukrainian president to attend the NATO summit in Washington in July. It's important to visit Kiev again and meet with President Zelensky. The situation is difficult, but it is not too late for Ukraine to prevail, and more support is on the way, Stoltenberg wrote in his ex-post ahead of his surprise visit to Ukraine. In early April, Stoltenberg proposed a 100 billion euro five-year package of military aid to Ukraine that would give the Western alliance a more direct role in providing support to Kiev. NATO declined to comment on Stoltenberg's proposals but an official from the alliance said foreign ministers would discuss the best way to organize NATO's support for Ukraine, to make it more powerful, predictable and enduring. It should be noted that today's visit was Stoltenberg's third trip to Kiev since Russia's full-scale invasion of the country, with previous visits on April 20 and September 28 last year.
Oh, my God.